by the way that Michelle is talking right here, <laughs> she, she knows, knows something. something. She knows yes, something. Yes, she's not guessing. She knows. She knows something that you and I don't know. Mm. Master Jesus, God, God is, is a, a good God. God is awesome, God. Yo, this is Henry. I am Monique. We are about to react on a speech or whatsoever it was that uh, Michelle Obama yeah. did. You yes. know, he, she said, right? Yeah. We're not going to show the whole thing because it's 18 minutes long. Yeah. But we'll show a little bit. Yeah, we're just going to show some important thing mm -hmm. that is very spiritual yeah you know in this ministry is all about godly things and if he's not godly if he goes into demonic if he goes into spiritual things and when god begin to you know bring the attention to us that's when we cry out to people yes. hey hey because the bible said a warning comes before destruction so we want to play this video and you know so you can see where we are coming from then you can talk to yourself at the same time mm -hmm. yes. All right? let's go let's get it now I understand that my message won't be heard by some people we live in a nation that is deeply divided and I am a black woman Oh, go ahead. I was going to say something. And that made me say nothing. <laughs> Black woman. Yeah, we get it. I know it. They you want know. everybody to know about race. Yes. It's all about yeah. the race thing. Yeah. You got to put that in there. You got to put that in there because that's how they manipulate Americans. And uh, I, I, I don't know about y'all, but I'm kind of sick of the whole thing because this is what they are planning to divide the country well they have already tried to divide the country with this racism stuff right okay. um to bring distraction um up on trump in his election okay and uh it all started with this george floyd yeah um supposedly attack right you know, so now the truth has come out about George Floyd. Yeah. Ain't nobody talking about it no nobody. more. Nobody. Nobody ain't. Post. No, nobody ain't talking about it no more. Nobody's bringing it up no more. And when God, I'm not trying to cut you off. Mm -hmm. When God says it's a distraction. Yep. I remember my husband made a video about it's that. It's a distraction. This video right here. It says it's a distraction. Mm -hmm. But people don't care they don't because care. they believe it's all about the color thing mm -hmm. but it's a spiritual thing yeah it's but. a spiritual thing so just in case you, you haven't uh, been updated about george floyd well they have uh released the the beginning videos of how he was being very disrespectful and uh, what's the other word they use he was being uh, um, aggressive and, uh, yeah uh, uh, he was resisting, resisting arrest yeah. he was resisting arrest being disrespectful so they don't show that part although yeah. we all know uh that nobody shouldn't be getting killed yeah. uh the way he got period. killed yeah period but you see how that they didn't show that part you know um they wanted you know racism to rise up and, and you, know, you get out of control mm -hmm. and we don't need that in this mm -hmm. country we don't we was doing perfectly fine um so that's exactly what they're trying to do and and the lord um gave you a dream yeah. if you want to tell everybody right now while we're at it which, which dream? you had a dream that you've seen um more murders because of race oh yeah yeah so i saw i saw it uh, it's a vision yeah. I saw little kids 
you know, uh, black and white fighting. Mm -hmm. And the black little kid brought a big, huge stone, you know, to hit the, 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 the other guy, uh, the other mm -hmm. little boy in the mm -hmm. head, and he missed out. And the, 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 the white little boy picked up the stone and, you know, uh, smashed his head. Like, I woke up from that vision. It was so crazy. And, and that's disturbing. horrible. Yeah. That's horrible. Um, anything adults do mm -hmm. will trickle down to the youth. Yeah. And uh, we got to do better, man. We got to pray, y'all. Yeah. Let's keep going. Speaking at the Democratic Convention, but enough of you know me by now. You know that I tell you exactly what I'm feeling. You know I hate politics, but you also know that I care about this nation. You know how much I care about all of our children. Do they really care about all our children? Mm -mm. Do they really care about this country? No. Well... It's just a bunch of fake, um, pre-recorded, you know how I feel. Mm -hmm. If you really, really uh, want to express how you feel, it shouldn't have been pre-recorded, in my opinion. Yeah, and uh, you're talking about how you care about our children. Mm -hmm. This sympathy, hey. I don't do politics, as she was saying here. I don't. <laughs> but these same children that they're talking about is the same uh, abortion that they are going to allow, the same, all those things. Because whether that. you like it or not, if you, whether you like it or not, let me repeat what God told me. Uh, people, people need to pray and go and vote that... Uh, that Joe Biden never wins because people are gonna see crazy things. If this man stays in office, if Democrats take the office, Christians be ready. Uh, uh, it's gonna be crazy in this country. Yes. And, and I remember, go ahead. And that's a warning from the Lord. And God, there's another video, if you all follow this ministry, that the Satan, uh, satanic agenda is to make this country like. Uh, Syria. Syria to make this country like Syria mm -hmm. be very alive right so if you take one thing from my words tonight it is this if you think things cannot possibly get worse trust me they can and they will if we don't make a change in this election do you see that big threat do you see that big That's message That's a big threat right there yeah that's one thing about uh you know if you listening to people if you pay attention to people always remember to underline some words remember what she just said you can go back and replay it again all right if you think that things will not get worse if you think that things will not get worse let trump win yeah. But if you think things is going to be better, let Joe Biden win. Yeah. Man, can you see what she was saying? Mm -hmm. Remember back in the day when Obama was talking about pandemic? Yes, he was. He was talking about pandemic. As well as Bill Gates. Every one of them was in that converse, conversation. Believe me, they're probably best friends. So mm -hmm. that means they have set that plan. Mm -hmm. yep. If Clinton, Hillary Clinton would have won, that you would never hear pandemic. Mm -mm. Never. Oh my God. Do you know even, okay, I hate to talk about Bart Simpson. Okay. But Bart Simpson had kind of put it that, you know, if Trump wins, all the destruction is going to happen. It's That's so funny nice. because. By the way that Michelle is talking right here, <laughs> she, she knows, knows something. something. She knows yes, something. Yes, she's not guessing. She knows. She knows something that you and I don't know. Mm -hmm. She's repeatedly saying, "If you think it, things is gonna get, things is not gonna get bad." With look in her face, yes. just look in her face and see what she's talking about. Because mm -hmm, she knows. There's a lot of things that. 
we the Christians need to understand the body movement, the, the art movement, the language of spiritual things. You need to be alive on those things. Yes. Look at how aggressive, how intense, how focused she got. Uh, she's on mm -hmm. saying this. Yes. She's saying it with confidence. Confident that mm -hmm. they know. Fear tactics. They know mm -hmm. what they have planned to do. Yes. If Joe Biden will not be in that office, is coming. Mm -hmm. yep. That this is the, the, this is the reason why we are doing this is because we want to call a prayer. We want to come yes. in agreement once a month prayer. Yes. For this nation, not just to be talking about it. We need to come once yes. in a month or two times in a month. We we need the Lord to Cry. hear our voice, Christians across the world. We shouldn't be allowing things like this mm -mm. when they prophesy. Remember, the Bible said that uh, life and death is in the power of, of tongue. the tongue. We have to pray because, let's be honest, when things happen to America, it affects other countries. Yes. You know, so we have to pray. We have to scream and cry out loud to the Lord and ask the Lord to come against these satanic attacks and agendas that they're planning mm -hmm. because they're trying to control us. They're yeah. trying to, it's like they're trying to spank us. Yeah. You put Trump in office. Then we go, we're gonna, we're gonna whoop more. the mess out of you. We're gonna attack your mom. Mm -hmm. We're gonna yeah. bewinch your mom. Mm -hmm. We're gonna do witchcraft Believe me, on your mom. All that plan. And you know, um, we did a video prophetically. The Lord showed us um, that witchcraft is coming. Yeah. Is uh, is attacking this country, and you, we're gonna see a lot of death, and we're gonna see race wars. Mm -hmm. Okay, so they have planned this all yeah. to try to control who we vote for, and they so um, desperate. Yeah. Uh, they're so desperate, so desperate um, that even Biden picked a VP that is black and i know people say she's not black she black in my opinion her mother is indian her dad is jamaican she's black who cares if if she's not i mean the, the point is they used her I think, mm. uh, a, a brown skinned woman to manipulate the black people our black people okay so we gotta know desperation is is what is they have they're so desperate so that desperate. they're they're willing to play those mind games and control yeah. and i think a lot of black people are waking up yeah they seeing it satan is not dumb people mm -hmm. think satan is if dumb. biden would wouldn't have picked a black woman yeah oh uh, it would have been very hard it would have been really really bad for him he knows it yeah he, he really knows it he do yeah mm, let's keep going okay if we have any hope of ending this chaos, we have got to vote for Joe Biden like our... Wow. Oh, you, you should This lady right. is bold. She is so bold. Mm -hmm. Our lives depend on it. Our lives depend on it. I know Joe. He is a profoundly decent man. He is a profoundly decent man. He is a profoundly decent man guided by faith. Wait, can you pause that? Can, he I'm was a, sorry. I, that what she said, I, I just see the spirit of lie. Like she, she barely didn't even want to say it. You, if you want to play it back, you'll see how she, she was lying. You can tell when someone's lying. She know he, she know he's not going to be good at the job. She knows that. She knows it. Oh. Now she said confidently, she said it with confidence. Yeah that if we don't vote for Biden, that time is going to be hard. Like I can see the confidence in her on that. Right. But the confidence of when she spoke about Joe Biden was very like, I'm making it up. You didn't see that. Yeah, let's see. Guided by faith. He was a terrific vice president. She's lying. He knows what it takes to rescue an economy, beat back a pandemic and lead our country. To win. And he listens. Yeah. Like one thing from my words tonight, it is this. If you think things cannot possibly get worse, trust me, they can and they will if we don't make a change in this election. 
if we have any hope of ending this chaos, we have got to vote for Joe Biden like our lives depend on it. I know Joe. He is a profoundly decent man guided by faith. Can you see it? He yeah. was a terrific vice president. Anybody would deserve he it. knows know what it takes to rescue an economy, beat back a pandemic and lead our country. And he listens. I bet he do. He listens, all right, because he's being controlled oh and, he, and people are telling him what he to listens. do. So he listens, all right, and he, he listens. listens. I, I don't think we're, how much we got left. I think we're gonna stop it here. Get, yeah, but I'm gonna remind yeah. everybody they're planning to make this race war uh, more of a headache for us. Um, they're planning more disease. They're pr planning to destroy more of our countries. Mm -hmm. um, hurricanes, tornadoes, and uh, if you don't think that people are are or have the ca capacity to do such, pray about that. The Lord will show you. Yeah. Um, they're planning. I forgot what I said. <laughs> they're planning a lot of things. Oh, food shortages. They're trying to. They're planning that already. They're they're trying to bring destruction on this uh, in this America uh, across the world. Um, because they're trying to retaliate. Yeah. They're trying to retaliate against Trump. And uh, we got to pray. I don't want none of this to happen. Yeah. Um, 2020 was a mess. And I don't want to see 2021 get even worse. I don't want to see it. And, you know, she made her little threats. But uh, Michelle Obama need to know that if God is for us, who can be against who us? Be against Amen. Us. Who can be against us? It got uh, Trump is in office and it's a lot of stuff. Woo, y'all. It's a lot of stuff that we're going to be so happy that he's going to be able to do. Yeah. And I'm excited for Same here. I'm, I'm excited. Same what here. the Lord has showed us, I'm excited yeah. for it. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Yeah. You can tell. You can tell he's, he's like, we're done. <laughs> yeah, we're done. Yeah, we're done. We're Listen, great. if you're not subscribed to Henry and Money, go ahead and do so. You know why? Because it will automatically make, make it Christian. cool Christian. Because cool Christians. We hang out over here. God bless you all. We love you guys. Bye. Bye.